and I'm going to do another tutorial today on the standard dumbbell curl. Now, I'm sure everyone knows what a dumbbell curl is, but just for the sake of repeating it, I thought I'd do it again. But this time, I'm just going to point a few little uh, tips to keep in mind when doing the dumbbell curl. Now, those of you who know, this is your bicep, and your bicep is meant to close your arm. That's what it does. Now, we're going to use an open palm grip, and we when we do that, we isolate just the bicep. If we put our thumb up, we use the bicep, but also a, mu a muscle down here called brachioradialis. But for today's exercise, we're gonna do that because you can use it with dumbbells or a barbell, okay? Now, being a bicep exercise, what does that mean? It means you only wanna use the bicep. So don't use your shoulder, don't do any of this sort of stuff. Don't use your back. None of this, it purely is that, okay? Purely is that. Now, it looks something like this. Standing dumbbell curl is stand with arms nice and straight, shoulders back and down, and then just curl up. Just like that, closing the angle. That's all it is. If you want to make it a bit harder, which is what I recommend for all single joint exercises, which involves only one joint, I like to do nine full reps in a nice slow controlled movement. Then I like to do nine lows like that, then nine highs, and then I like to do nine fulls. Of course, being video land, I can call my nines twos, okay? So that's that, right? That's your standing dumbbell curl. If, you, if your arms are behind you, so this, if you were seated, so I'll just give you a quick idea. Imagine you're seated on a bench, and it's an incline bench. Are we okay, honey? Can you yes, see yes. Right. If my arms come behind me and I do a curl, you're predominantly getting most of the tension in the upper bicep. If my arms are in front of me, like this, and I do a curl, the most of the tension is in the lower bicep. But when we're standing or seated and the arms are straight, you're getting the whole bicep. So, for the purpose of the exercise today, the objective is to isolate the biceps, which means keep your shoulders still, just bend from the elbow up, and, and uh, utilize your nines, which means nine full reps, nine low, nine high, nine full. And be sure to check out our uh, videos where we demonstrate these in, in, in workouts that we use. Thanks very much, guys. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for my next uh, tutorial.